All right, guys, got the fireplace on. Just let it, I had to get a, a lot of air out of the line because after changing tanks to the bigger one, um, I'm gonna get the, uh, get the fireplace fans plugged in right away. Um, as far as I can. Let's see. What am I gonna do? Oh yeah, I'll just plug it in off one of these power packs. Because why not? Off of Charles's power pack there to run the fans. And I'm going to try Primo's um, this power pack here, the solar one he gave, donated to me a long time ago. I had it charged up. I don't know if it works well, but I'm going to find out. So I'm going to plug this fan in and see if it runs. doesn't even run this uh, my fan up here this might be a dud I feel the fans blowing there's we got heat there I don't know what's going on with this thing I'll put it on charge again um, just to see but We'll use Primo's other uh, power pack to do the fan up here. There we go. Perfect. So that looks nice and clear, guys. After I cleaned it up and took all that crap out of there. Right? A little bit of moisture and stuff and remember I did all that cleaning outside on the pipes and I removed that center piece here that was a screen um, so hopefully no more carbon issues and there was the power pack I was talking about for powering this fan up here and we I can feel the fans blowing so and the fireplace is completely powered off little ba battery packs here so I got two fans running on this power pack it's already down to 97 percent and this one is running the top fan and then actually I'm also going to turn this fan on above it and turn the radio on because I've been listening to this Kavanaugh thing in the USA with the uh, Kavanaugh and the Me Too movement and it's pretty insane so I'm gonna be checking that out so so far so good on the fireplace I'll give you updates on that guys got the ceiling 12 volt ceiling fan powered by the off-grid solar pa panels well everything's off-grid here Unlike some people's uh, supposed YouTube channels that claim they're off-grid and they're not. <coughs> Troy Reed. <coughs> um, but anyway, so uh, I'm going to cut the hole in and uh, I'll be back once I give you some progress on that. Guys, um, I'm just taking a break from cutting the hole in the wall. I need to attach a longer blade to get the rest of that foam out of there. But I got a mess going on. So far, so good on the fireplace. No carbon, no crap. I got my radio on in the background. The only thing that's going on is I, this power pack that I that's running the fireplace right now is draining down pretty quickly. 57 
percent already that should not be happening but this power pack is actually the one I built out of those reclaimed laptop batteries so I those batteries might be pooched I don't know but anyway this is a 9 volt rechargeable battery station that I got from my dad for free because he didn't have a use for it and he had a couple rechargeable energizer 9 volt batteries so those worried about carbon monoxide guys don't worry I put the new rechargeable 9 volt battery in the carbon monoxide detector tested it and it's over on the floor in there you want it kind of knit the lowest spot in your place because carbon monoxide uh, is heavier than air and pools to the ground so anyway um, that's charging on 120 volt but if that fan uh, well what I'm gonna do is probably shut the heat off because I got it up to um, let me just grab the grab the uh, uh, temperature probe here and this will tell us I got this back up to we're up to 63 Fahrenheit right now and it's 70 outside so I say if I turn this off now and just continue to run the fans it will uh, basically solve my issues at this point right so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then uh, I'm just listening to the radio on the uh, Kavanaugh deal what a complete joke that is I'll shut the pilot off even there so I'm just gonna continue to let the fans run get rid of the heat I still feel the fans blowing the hot air so they're doing it their job and uh, yeah so that's just so we know the fireplace is running good so far and that's the main thing and my damn solar thing here keeps falling down but whatever that's for something else I gotta fix but I'll see what happens to the amps on this power pack down here that's running the fireplace this power pack may be no good but we'll find out I have three more other ones I can try that are also from the laptop batteries so there you go so uh, yeah we'll see you guys uh, in a bit once I get back changing the blade for that hole